How to be a nurse, but become one of the successful nurse in the industry. Welcome back, it's Nurse Yalda from Rejuvenation Clinic. Let's talk about how, as a nurse, you could be extremely successful and make your dream come true. I became a nurse uh, back in 2017. I decided to work at the hospital because I really wanted to save people's life. But on the side, I also decided to learn more about aesthetic field. My dream came true. I have the most beautiful office in Northern Virginia, Tyson's Corner. I have a treatment room and wonderful staff that we provide all the non-surgical treatment, whether it's cool sculpting body contour, is Morpheus Aid, with, which is a skin tightening treatment, and all the non-injectable and non-surgical treatment in our practice. And I'm very excited to also introduce Rejuvenation Static Academy to you guys. Let's start from day one. I was working at the hospital, and I didn't know how I would be able to have my clinic when I wasn't able to afford our, my rent. I met a lovely lady. And she was so kind and generous and she knew how passionate I am about owning my business. And she offered me a day working, coming to her office and not paying great for three months. The journey started from there. All I did is I stay focused. I work hard. I introduced myself to the community. I started from nowhere. I didn't have the money to pay for my rent. At the moment, I was the nurse injector. I was the marketing lady and I was the clean lady and I did it all by myself. You will meet people that they will motivate you. You will meet people that they will discourage you, but you just listen to your heart and you listen to your guts and you know you can do it. You avoid all the noises out there because there's going to be people that they're not going to love you. They're not going to support you, but they're also going to be great people that they will support you. They encourage you. Make sure you have a plan and stick to that plan. Dream B. My goal was to have the most beautiful office in the next four or five years, but my dream came through within just three years. It hasn't even hit the three years. And the funny part, all of this happened during COVID. My piece of advice to everyone one is make sure you do write your goals, whether as a nurse injector, whether as a lawyer, whether as a dancer, make sure you do have your short term goals and your long term goals. And these are the things that you have to follow. If you want to achieve something, you have to repeat those steps every day. Those moments are important. Because one thing in life you're going to lose is time and time is precious. So make sure you do have your plan. Make sure you surround yourself with good people. You will meet bad people in your life as well. But those are the people that they're going to teach you the best lesson of your life. One of the examples I can tell you guys, I had a staff that was stealing from me. Of course, it did hurt my feeling. But the outcome from that was me becoming a stronger person, learning from my mistake and never repeating that. Do not let your mistake make you feel bad about yourself. Just avoid anything negative in your life because life, positive, negative, it's always gonna be like that. But pay more attention to good people in your life, people who encourage you and always try to be the best version of yourself. Don't compare yourself to other people because why? Why would you even do that? Compare yourself to yourself and try to become a better version of yourself. Well, thank you for watching this YouTube channel. Please like, subscribe and follow our page at Nurse Yalda. Thank you so much.